Our big story of the night now, a knife wielding suspect shot by a sheriff's deputy in Fountain Hills. Investigators say all of this started when he called police declaring his allegiance to ISIS and then started throwing rocks at officers when they arrived on the scene. Now newly released 911 call and body camera video shows the moment before an MCSO deputy shoots the 18 year old in Fountain Hills. The FBI is labeling the teenager as a terrorist, but until now providing no evidence to back up that claim. Team 12's Ryan Cody is live at the Maricopa County Sheriff's Office with what they're saying about it tonight. Ryan? And they're only releasing this new evidence after a judge demanded more transparency in the investigation. What you're about to hear is the 911 call 18 year old Ishmael Hamed made asking to see a sheriff's deputy in person, followed by the body cam footage of the encounter he had with the deputy who shot him. I live in Town Hills and um, I'm owing my allegiance to the Islamic State of Iraq and Syria. Please, mate, I just want a cop to come real quick. Hank, back off. Back off. Drop it. Drop the knife. 740, he's got a knife coming at me. Drop the knife. I will shoot you. Drop the knife. I will shoot you. Drop the knife. Shoot it. I Drop the knife. And just one second later, the deputy fired two shots at Hamed, who then did drop the knife and dropped to the ground as well. He was taken into custody, where he later recovered at the hospital. He is still in MCSO custody. Now, the FBI and Maricopa County Sheriff Paul Penzone did take several questions, but they would not reveal anything about the investigation into these terrorism charges. Tonight, we are live at MCSO. Ryan Cody, 12 News. All right, Ryan, thanks.